Well, good morning from Northern Ants. I figured today's video I would show you how the fruit fly setup worked. I made that video some time ago, uh, setting it up, showing how I was going to do it, and I figured you're probably wondering how they actually did. So I'm going to show you that today. So I you like my new hat. <laughs> I just got that the other day. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get that one from my store, but I could probably make that for you too if you were interested if you stopped by my merch store. Okay, let's go over and take a look at the fruit flies. Okay, this is where I've got them. I'm hoping the, because we're right next to the furnace, I'm hoping I can get, get this done before the furnace kicks in. It is warmer today, so I just keep them, if this is in the basement, I just keep them down here. This is the big one that I had, you had seen me set up. If you haven't got a chance to check out the previous video where I made the fruit fly setup, uh, I'll put the link uh, in one of these corners right now. So, okay, hope you enjoy. And I had set this small one up. This is, I've been pulling from both. They are like super thick in there. I will. Um, Let's see if I can, I don't want <laughs> them to all try to get out, but as you can see there's a, plenty of food in there, and get the cover on before, they, before they're all over everywhere. And let's see, I can turn the, my light on so I can, so you can see down inside this other one a little better. This one I've got the stuff around the rim so they're not gonna be getting out. But you can see down in there, whoop, that's a lot of noise, sorry. I was pull. I pulled some from here. Funny thing is, is the ones inside of here are bigger than the ones in this, the yellow topped container. But as you can see, they're a uh, doing very well. I didn't know if my method was going to work or not. I had never tried it. It was the first time I ever had fruit flies, so it was a, an experiment. Let's see if I can get zoomed in. And as you can see, it was a success. <laughs> so now if you want to try my method that I had set up following my video, you know that it can succeed. And down here too I've got, I've had these two tubs, these have got worms in them for fishing. I don't know if I can, this has got to be some of like the richest dirt. I've, I've been worth, been growing these for, I say, Six years? Five, six years? Seven years, maybe? All you do is just... If anybody wants to go fishing, it's, uh... <laughs> got plenty. And then that tub's the same way, the one next to it. But all, all you do is just throw your... I've just been throwing in table scraps and old bread and things like that in there. And it, that works really well too. I try to keep a rock on top because it'll, uh, they will try to crawl out it, even though a mouse did chew its way in there. And then I've got a, this, this is the fish tank. It's a 35 gallon. There's just, uh, mostly just snails in there right now. <laughs> Maybe a couple of crayfish. But, uh, that's the one I had, uh, the fish, the ant farm set up in, uh, the polyergus. And some Formica black ants that I had uh, in one of my past videos. So. Okay, well that's uh, that's the fruit flies and the worms that I wasn't planning on showing, but it, that's what it is. They're there. <laughs> um, well, thank you so much for watching. I will probably, yeah, I will. I'll throw some ants at the end of this video um, and stuff. Always, like I say. 
always want some ants in my ant videos. <laughs> so, well, thank you so much for watching. You have a great rest of your day. Somebody's waiting at the top of the stairs for me to get done. I don't know if I need the light off. I do hope you're enjoying the video. Please hit that like button if you are. Also, make sure you are subscribed and hit that bell icon because I'm downloading videos all the time, be it game, ant, animals, anything like that. I'm going to be doing live streams for my ants on Saturdays from now on. Plus, I do live streams whenever the deer show up. So have that bell icon hit so you know exactly when I go live. Thank you so much. And I hope to see you soon.